Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Troy for Ancient Cartography. I've got something to share with you today about this Mayan Stella. If you look at it, now listen, what I'm gathering from it you might not understand, but I mean, I'm just telling you what I'm seeing as a map and what it's telling. It shows the symbol of Solomon, a sword, a great chief, a uh, child sucking his thumb, he's cut in half right here. But he's telling the story about three places, the right hand, and then down here it looks, if you look at it, it looks like he's holding a head. David cut off Goliath's head, so I believe Solomon's telling the story, and he's showing three locations, like where it happened, then the right hand, and then there's a sheath, it turns into where the other place is, which is Lookout Mountain, where Solomon set up New Jerusalem, and he put the sword up, I guess. But I want, there's a big twist here, and I want to walk you through it. I'd like to show you an aerial of the place they're talking about where this happened with the head. Uh, on the side of this Stella, there are marks, and you might not can see them here, but I'm going to just lay it out, and when we get online or something, or you can look at it, there's some marks right here. And then there's a line that goes down right here, and then comes over, and then goes up, and then I'll show you these two areas where the legs are, and it goes up to the second thumb, and goes up to the right hand where the door is. And then there's an aerial of a face like this one with a headdress, Okay, and then even at the door, I'm going to show you that. So let me go ahead and show you the, the aerial here, what we're talking about. Okay, here's the marks, the details. Okay, and there were more of them, but the, the dam kind of made the river a little wide there. So there's the marks, okay, that were coming down the side. And then here's that line, and it comes over, okay. And here's these two marks right here. It goes up to where he's sucking his thumb and right to the door. Now look at the door. What do you see? See the chin, the nose, the eye, the headdress right here of an aerial. Now this is very, very old, but anyhow it shows right there now. With that in mind, when you go to the door, let me click that one. Okay. There's the, a mark, okay, there's the, the guy right there's nose and face with a headdress, and there's a mark right here behind him, and then there's a rectangular of marks and numbers, and you see them right there, okay? We have it marked on the Stella. There's the marks, there's the chief's head and dress, and there's the mark right there. Same thing. Okay, now there's a twist to this. And you're going to love this if this camera hold out because it stops on me. Now watch. I want to lay this out real quick and show you something. Okay. Here's two aerials. Now look. Here's the aerial of Troy. The ruins of Troy. See this Y upside down? And then look. It looks like a D with a line. And then uh, here's these marks up here. And it looks like they have a fake river with no water. But there's the marks, right? Well, look back at our aerial again that we just laid out. There's the Y upside down. There's the D in the line. And there's the marks. And there's the river. Now, just in the last minute or two, telling you about some of these details, I have a lot of maps that point out this aerial of this temple. Okay? It's telling me that the ruin of, ruins of Troy are a reenactment. And they couldn't come back across to here, so they used the channel over there and made a reenactment. This one holds the temple and, the, and the, the details of it. So now you've heard it first right here on Ancient Cartography Channel. This is Troy. Have a nice day.